the Acton Area Controller, Federal Operations Unit Zone A, and his team arrived at the government warehouse in Lagos in company of officers of the National Drug Law Enforcement Agency, Lagos State Command. It's about 721 kilograms of cannabis sativa in two separate um, uh, seizures. One with defendant, like I said, the other one without defendant. Now, with the increase in the rate of criminality in Nigeria, it is the responsibility of government to ensure that life of, of individuals is secured. Now, criminals will take this and they don't look at life as meaningful again. That accounts for why you see some of these small boys inside traffic. They will accost people and they will just have a shot at anybody. And this is part of what is making them hide. They're here for the handing over of bags of substances suspected to be cannabis sativa, also known as Indian hemp, seized in Lagos and Ogun State. However, these items, equivalent of 14 trucks of 50 kg of foreign per boiled rice, were seized by the unit in the last three weeks. The controller attributes these achievements to the resilient nature of officers of the unit. From Olokuta, Ojaodon, Masai, Ayetoru, Imeko, those are the areas where all these motorcycles were brought in. As you see, it has been a recurring decimal in Nigeria now that the current trend of smuggling now is through the use of motorcycles because of the porous borders. Based on the mileage, the unit took delivery of additional five gun patrol trucks to assist them in daily enforcement activities across the southwest zone.